government and all policymakers to create conducive working environments for practicing journalists across the country has again been stressed. This is coming from the chairman of the Correspondence Chapel of the Nigeria Union of Journalists, Kwa State Council, Abdul Hakim Garba. Garba made the appeal during the grand finale of the annual press week activities of the Correspondence Chapel, noting that the media industry is the most distressed in the country as journalists have been subjected to irregular salaries, no allowance, no insurance policy despite many and serious hazards journalists face daily on the line of duty, alleging that security agencies also harass journalists needlessly. The media industry is the most distressed in the country. Our members are subjected to irregular salaries, no allowances, despite the many answers that attend our jobs. We are often needlessly harassed by security agencies. To cap it all, there are no insurance policies available to us. To understand this point, SARS, one of our awards today is dedicated to the daughter who was subjected to quality transfer for reporting the other side of the political divide in a participatory multi-party democracy that we practice. We understand your limitations as governors, but as chief executive of your respective state, you can be our ambassador in the power circles where policy decisions are made. In your state, too, you can also be our grand patron, factoring our interest in your decisions as governors. High points of the annual press week event was award presentation to some deserving journalists who have distinguished themselves in their bids and the quasi governor Abdurrahman Abdurazak who backed the Human Capital Development Advocate Award. Meanwhile, the state deputy governor, Kaudi Alabi, who represented the governor, Abdurazak, noted that the award is dedicated to the people of the state with assurance that the present administration will continue to deliver more dividends of democracy to the people of the state. To the Almighty God and to the people of Kwasi, I receive this award. My team and I feel very honored with this recognition by the Kwasi Prosperity Chapter of the Nigeria Union of Journalists. AUJ, we do not take it for granted. This award is a challenge for administration to go to prioritize and deliver on the most basic needs of our people and make life worth living for all of them. We are proud of the journey so far and we will continue to challenge ourselves to beat our own record in these key areas. We cannot do this alone Hence, we call for continued support of all the stakeholders, including the media, as we commit more resources and energy to the delivery of privileges of democracy. The theme of the 2022 Press Week of the Correspondence Chapel Kwara State Council of NUJ is re-engaging the media for credible democratic process.